channel so today I'm gonna be doing five easy hairstyles that you guys can do on yourself I'm sorry I've been gone for two weeks I've been sick and I'm finally feeling better if you like the video give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you want to see more hairstyles from me so without further ado let's go okay so I'm in my bathroom and if I'm looking over here it's because my mirror is over here so yeah, I just wanted to put that little disclaimer in there. Without further ado, let's go. Okay, so for look one, you're going to want to get your hair and gather it into a half up, half down up do. And after you get that hair, you're going to want to twist it into a bun around itself, like I'm showing you here. After you're done twisting it around itself, you're going to want to get a hair tie and just wrap it around and secure it. Now that your bun is how you like it, I'm just going to pull some hairs out, my baby hairs up in front to frame it, and then I'm going to pull some hairs on the top of my head. And just kind of mess around with it. I'm going to pull the bun a little bit. And after that, this is the finished product. It's super cute and easy. Okay, so for hairstyle number two, you're going to want to gather all your hair into a low ponytail and secure it with a hair tie. I'm going to pull these hairs so it looks looser. Now you need to get a section of your hair from the top of your ponytail and separate it into three different strands and just start a normal braid all the way down the hair. Now that you're done braiding it all the way down, you're going to want to secure it with an elastic. Now I'm just going to start pulling and tugging pieces of the braid just to make it look looser and not as tight. Now that I'm done pulling and tugging on that strand of hair, this is what it looks like. For hairstyle number three, you're going to want to section off two pieces of hair in the front of your hair, in front of your head, and get the rest of your hair and put it into a low ponytail. Now you're going to want to get those two sections in front and start twisting them. Then you want to take them to the back of your head and tie them off with an elastic. Now I'm gonna get that hair and I'm gonna flip it over just like I'm doing here. And then I'm gonna tighten it, tighten it. And then you're gonna wanna get your ponytail and release that. And then if there's any hairs that are popping out, I'm just gonna bobby pin those down. After you're done bobby pinning any of those hairs that were popping up, after that, you're basically done, and it's super elegant looking. And I'm just curling this hair because it was not cooperating with me. For hairstyle number four, you're going to want to flip your hair upside down and put your hair into a high ponytail. And then I'm just going to comb back any of my flyaways, like that one. This is what my ponytail looks like, and it's pretty plain, so I'm just going to massage my hair with my fingers to give it a little bit more volume. 
that I'm doing this, I don't really know how to explain that, but yeah. This gives it a lot more volume than just a plain ponytail. For the last hairstyle, you're going to want to leave it into a ponytail and start twisting it and turning it so it forms a bun. And then you're going to want to secure it with a hair tie. Now I'm just going to play around with the hair, try to make it look bigger. And there were all these hairs, so I just got an elastic and put it over, and that solved the problem. And now I'm getting some bobby pins, and I'm securing the bun down. I'm just going to pull some hairs out to make it look bigger, and then you're basically done after this. Okay guys, so I am back. I hope that you guys got some new hairstyle inspiration. If you guys want to try something new out with your hair, as always, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you aren't already. Until next week, bye guys.